All right, good evening, everybody. What you need to know, this is the last pleasant night for quite some time. Slight Saturday morning rain chance. Keep that in mind. Not a bad idea to have the umbrella just in case and a dangerous heat wave is about to begin on Sunday and it really is going to be dangerous because it's going to last for uh, quite some time on Saturday. Not bad. A good start in the 60s to begin the day. 79 at 9 o'clock, 84 at noon, 87 at 3 o'clock. I'll take that in mid June. Uh, the problem is by Sunday it's really going to get nasty. Here is future cast. Let me show you this slight rain chance that I was talking about. Uh, weak little system comes in here tomorrow may give us some sprinkles in the morning, uh, some brief light rain, but I would enjoy it because it's going to get hot and it's probably not going to rain on most of you, but uh, just be prepared for that chance. Saturday night is going to start getting muggy and then Sunday it's just going to turn flat out hot and humid and actually we're going to go into dangerous heat. Watch this now. This is Sunday at 10 o'clock in the morning. 91 degrees is what our model shows. Look at this. It shows East Arkansas hitting and exceeding over 100 degrees and it shows Memphis hitting 100 degrees at 5 o'clock Sunday afternoon. That'd be the first time in two years. Uh, so that's a big deal. I mean, that's a uh, you're going right into a major heat wave like that. And look at this. I mean, this is crazy. Monday at 6 a.m. 89 degrees. That's pretty hot. If these numbers come true, this is going to be a serious heat wave. Um, as a matter of fact, this is Sunday's heat index forecast map. We'll have a heat index already at 8 a.m. But watch what happens in the afternoon after we get past lunchtime. 103, 104, 105. I mean, this is going to be dangerous heat because we're going right into it uh, from some actually decently pleasant weather. Uh, so this is going to be a big deal, this heat wave. And another reason it's going to be a big deal is because, first of all, it's so early in the season. And secondly, it's going to go on for quite some time. Please look before you lock people and pets. Please, please, please do that uh, because it gets hot in a car really, really quick. This is what I'm talking about with that seven day heat index and heat wave. Look at this upper 90s for highs, overnight lows just below 80. That is nasty. We're going to be you're going to have to hydrate for sure in this, Rudy. Yuck. All right. Thanks.